win to less of them. I'll be cutting your hair, you'd be like, yeah, I kill, killed this dude last week. <laughs> Good morning everyone. I actually fell asleep last night after having a walk around the beach doing some a little workout. This morning I'm on my way to get to Trim. I look rough. We're gonna go into a barber's. I actually called them before. I asked if I could work there. They said, listen, it doesn't really work like that because everyone's on commission. Oh my god, this this barnet needs to be sorted out ASAP because I've been sleeping with the air conditioning on. It's made me very nasally. Get to this barber shop. That's where you good? Uh, I think I spoke to someone the other day. Yeah, that was me. Yeah. What's up, man? Joe, yeah, good, man. Joe, right? Yeah, that's the one. The zero line, just below where my crown is. The zero line, just below there, fade here. Here, my hair's thinning. So when you cut it down, just be careful with these two points and then shape up the front. I'm going bald, man. about the trim one thing I will notice when anyone cuts my hair from the way that we cut hair is they don't clean their tools ever I had to actually ask him to clean his tool even when he was like cutting the top of my hair he uh, just yamming away at the scissors it wasn't like separating it trying to make sure it's straight to be fair I'm probably gonna have to go home and fix it a little bit it's still a good trim it will do me do me justice but I'm probably gonna have to fix it a little bit okay so the plan of action now I am going to Miami Beach because it's beautiful out today and we're going to do a trim on the beach maybe two trims on the beach we'll see we're going to do get changed grab my barber kit and then we're going to head down to the beach while it's about 30 degrees out here it's beautiful out today yes bro good you good long time no see man long time no see is he your boys yeah these are my boys where's the dude with the really long hair benini where's benini oh yeah yes guys you all right joel nice to meet you, you what's up what's up you good what's up where did benini go <laughs> We got two trims. Who wants them? Oh, obviously, one for you. And who's the other one for? Quan. Yeah. Yeah. We can give one to Quan and Panini. Bro. What's up, man? I'm Joel. Nice to meet you. Oh, we'll get nice the to meet you. So you guys staying in Fort Lauderdale, right? Yeah. Uh, that area, yeah. Like Pompano Beach, Pompano. Yeah. Which is right above Fort Lauderdale. Cool. Like Ten minutes. Should we head towards the beach? Yeah. yeah. Let's go, man. <laughs> Do you live in Fort Lauderdale? No. We live know. in New York. You all live in New York, yeah? Yeah, we all live in New York. That's dope. Whereabouts in New York? There's like no good way to describe it. Two hours north of the city. Yeah. Two hours north of the city? Yeah. Yes. You want to trim, right? Yeah, it's a little bit off the end. Cool. So what are you guys doing up in Fort Lauderdale? Jet skis and all that stuff? We love to jet ski, but like, nah, we don't know anyone with jet skis. But oh, first. I don't know, we just hang out with friends, finding parties, I guess, I don't know. <laughs> Fair play, man. <laughs> So what do you want? A mullet? A mullet. Yeah? <laughs> Maybe a fade on the sides too. Why is it one you just from once now? I would say when I do this, yeah, just put it under your leg. Has he always wanted a mullet? No, it's just for like the past two months my friends have been like <laughs> You're You're pressuring pressuring me to get one to see what happens. <laughs> well it's long enough, so you're in luck. Yeah. So what's been the best thing you've done on spring break so far? I spontaneously went to Fort Lauderdale at 3 in the morning and drank Coronas on the beach. Oh uh, yeah? <laughs> yeah, it was fun. This is probably one of the highlights. <laughs> Hell yeah. It's crazy you can meet in the airport, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Talking about you like first day he came down. Yeah. He's like, bro, I met this YouTuber. Yeah, yeah. I, I came down, I was like, all right, because my friend from Ohio State University is also down here in yeah. Fort Lauderdale. Yeah. So I'm like, all right, I already got links coming. Let's go, let's go. I caught you in one of the states. That's You'll be like, I know him, I saw him. <laughs> Hi, Hi, Ma. Hi, Ma. Hi, Ma. <laughs> Thank you. 
So just before I finish your trim, what's been your favorite experience in life so far? In life? Yeah, man. Uh, running out into the Pacific Ocean after driving across the country in my like 20 year old Honda. <laughs> Grab a seat, bro. What's your name, man? Quan. Quan, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Awesome. What do you want to do with your hair, man? Pretty much get shorter on the side. And yeah. A little fade. And then back shorter. And like a little inch off the top. Like a taper, yeah? Yeah, yeah. All right, cool, cool. Do you find it quite hard to get good haircuts out here? It's actually impossible. Like, seriously. Well, you're in safe hands today. Because I've gone to like multiple different barbers, and they all, like, every single one messes me up. Do you not find that so frustrating that you can't just get a consistently good trim? It makes no sense. I've noticed the the standard out here to let's say Europe for instance yeah. is it's very very different. Like I've I've I sat in a in a barber's chair here and, and then I, I stepped out just because I knew he was gonna mess my hair up. You're gonna remember that London came correct. Yes, this is what's gonna happen. After this, we're just gonna have to fly off to wherever he is. Yeah. <laughs> As a barber, the, the chair seems like quite a safe place. So people start talking to you, they uh, start telling you all their, their dirty secrets. Confessions? Yeah, man, that's literally what happens, man. Get any murder confessions? <laughs> nah, not yet. Not yet. Uh, wait until I sit down. I'll be cutting your hair, you'll be like, yeah, I kill, killed this dude last week. <laughs> he was a waste of space. Yeah. <laughs> Do you find it the most difficult to find people that can cut your hair? Do you have to go to like women's salons? Yeah. You have to uh, go to women's? Yeah, you know, the um, male barbers, you know how that's... They don't know, how, what do, they, do they sort of turn you away when you go? <laughs> They'll be like, oh yeah, we don't have any female barbers right now. Right now. Uh, and at that point I'll be like, all right, whatever, just, just take it off. Boys, Phil. Oh, good. Great. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> yes, sir. Remember to like, subscribe, turn on comment, notifications. turn on notifications, ring that, that bell. Shit. Yes, boys. Follow the IG. Follow the TikTok. Follow everything. Thank you, man. Link in the description below. Go on, give me a little spin, all three of you. Look at the trims, man. <laughs> <laughs> awesome, guys.